Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to my channel. My cows need milking and there are eggs. 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 We have eggs. Eat egg. Eat egg. Drink some milk. Drink some more milk. And I'm full. I'm wested. And I feel strong. Did my door go bad again? Yeah, the glazed door goes bad. Why? The staircase stayed the same, though, so that's good. All of our floors look good. The basement door also went bad. There's two bug doors in this game. Open that window, please, Seth. It is so hot in this room. I'm sweating. Who thought you? Who'd ever thought you'd hear that in the middle of February? So all the floors are good. Everything looks. Everything's awesome. Yeah, open the Open the window, please, Seth. Do 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 do. I'm going into my hen house. Seth's been playing Luigi's Mansion. On the piano, it's now going through my head. I'm just gonna wait like a year before I take this stuff to the market, and I'll sell it all at once and get like a billion dollars. The eggs will go bad. Yeah, I'm just carrying all these eggs around in my pocket. I got them in my backpack. Here's eggs. I know they're like six months old, but is that okay? So we're at full production on the chick chickens. Full production on the cows. Oh, it rains in the barn. And here's the rain that we talked about last night, last time we were on. Uh, we knew that this was coming. Come on, Bessie. Give me that milk. Stinky moo. So we are out of field work for the day. Very sad, very sad state of affairs. Um... But we'll find stuff to do. First of all, I'll probably move the slurry wagon around a little bit and get that uh, basting. Tap, 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 tap. And, oh, cow butt. Okay, now it's not raining in the barn. It was raining in parts of the barn, but now... it. There was a huge bug fix, by the way, and it sounds like, you know, people are getting real negative about the DCMA strike and all this other stuff, and, you know, just hold the course. They'll get it sorted out. They're still working on the game. They haven't they haven't given up, so we shouldn't give up either. Um, supposedly they fixed a lot of bugs and smoothed out animations and stuff. The cows definitely are getting up and down smoother than they were before. So we got some more milks. We're not in a rush today to really do anything because there's not a whole lot to do. All right, cows, good job. I might have to restart my computer, though. Things are running kind of choppy. I was playing World of Tanks, and that was fine, but this is running like arse. Like, really choppy, man. Sometimes you just got to reboot. Oh, and I can't because I'm uploading shizzle sticks. Could be the rain, though, too. Yeah, this is really chunky. There's our, okay, no, now it's, now it's doing okay. Yeah, this weather's not doing so happy. It definitely hasn't been 30 days. I don't think our, our vegetables have grown. We can look in real quick and see this first row of tomatoes and see if they're done. We planted the first set of tomatoes before we planted anything else, so... Oh, <gasps> they're ripe! Oh, sweetness. If you're descending, yeah. Pick those tomatoes. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, so that's it. So that first group is ready. I think I'm going to, the next time I'm going to grow them all at once. So we will just leave. We're just going to grab those tomatoes. So now we can, we can make some color. We can sell. Let's see how much tomatoes sell for. Just. They probably don't sell for a whole lot, but I'd like to check it out and see. No. Violet, no. You guys, every day you want to buy a game for $5. Every day. Oh, I left the... Uh... Yeah, I'm going to have to reboot. This is running ridiculously terribly slow. So let's. Uh, I'm going to restart here. Anyway, we'll be right back, folks. Uh, it's not working. <laughs> There we go. Now we got a picture. <laughs> Good thing I checked that before I ran off. Let's see. So we're going to go 
crappy weather. Yeah, it's still a little chunky running. That could be the rain. Wait a minute, I want to go this way. Oh, it's getting mucky, this weather. The cows are having a fit. My poor cows are not free range. They want to be free, but no one's letting them. I'm just going to take my time getting over there. Sorry. Exit old pickup. Good to see you. Can I help you? Yeah, Joan, what's up? Let's see. Um, care to trade? Care to trade? Care to trade? Sure. Yes. What do you need? He's so stiff. Oh, I got a lot of tomatoes. 76 cents. So I could sell all of them for 98 bucks. Wow. Well, we'll sell 100 of them. Save some for food. Got 78. I'll keep. I mean, each day we get more. I eat a lot of eggs. So if I save 82, keep 10 of them, 12 of them. That should be good enough. You can see how I bought all these flowers and hearts. and So it's, uh, we're doing pretty good on our money right now. And uh, I got 22,000 bucks saved up. For what? I don't know yet. Once again, we're going to probably purchase a field today. Let's go ahead and look, take a look at what we got for choices. Um, it is indeed too wet to harvest for the day, though. So That's clearing up a little bit, but I don't trust that. I think it's going to rain all day. So let's go ahead and take a look. Um, we got this field up here, which is near to, nearer to the house than... Wait a minute. I thought we bought... Oh, no, it's the field next door that we bought. What's growing on here? I, I want to get stuff that's going to make straw. And that's going to be our first. This is this has been harvested. This is my field. This is the field I bought. I look for... <laughs> I don't know why I thought it wasn't done, but as you get closer, you're like, oh, this is not grown. These are just little stubs. So what do we got over here? Is this soybean? This kind of looks like soybean. It might be wheat, though. Park right here and see what that is. This is wheat, 100%, and it's 100% ready for harvest. 1.93 hectares. hectares. Um, and let's see. I'm going to field purchase. I probably will use my social points. Once again, my goal is to use social points for now to keep the prices down so we can get a lot of field space. The more field space we have, the more money we're going to make. So we'll buy that field. We are down to 15,000 euros. Let's see what else we can grab. 39,000 points. My pickup truck now has a... Oh, the interior is fixed again. What else is around here? we got our next door here. Is this the same field I purchased? Nope, this is a next door field. What we got growing here? This looks like corn. It's not either of the crops that I want. Yeah, it's corn, maize, as they call it. Over on this side, what do we got? This looks like something different. Lupine. Lupin. I wonder if lupine... I th somebody told me what it was. I think it's like... It's not barley. It's, um... Oh, boy. Uh-oh. Get out of that. <laughs> it's a mucky field. Mucky muck. Turn the lights on. So let's see. We bought that field over there. What do we got here? <gasps> Make sure I'm not driving in somebody's field. Here's another wheat field here. This looks like wheat. We should be able to afford this field also. Um, 8,000 euros plus 16,000 social points. Let's go ahead and do it. 
So we now have 22,000 socials and 6,900 euros. That's we're going to stop now. Uh, I th I'm going to guesstimate we'll be around forty or fifty thousand dollars when we're done with those two harvests. So um, we'll go ahead and do that tomorrow. We'll start it anyway. It's going to take a while today. Now it is raining. It would be fun. It keeps like raining and then not raining. It would be fun to play around with. I'm sorry, my I'm using my Steam controller to drive and. It doesn't work so well with the mouse controls. Uh oh, why did I go this way? Oh, Arthur. Ah, I gotta find my home. I don't know where I'm at. So I'm gonna turn right and then left at the intersection. <gasps> you hit the iPad. That's kind of funny. Okay, don't get down in there. So I'm gonna take the Comanche home. He's keeping it to himself. <laughs> There's some wild boar in the field. That's cool. We got to harvest our first tomatoes today. And it was super easy to do. Whoops. Eh, we'll just go in the back way. Sneak around this way. Crash. Very good at driving. All right, I'm gonna park the pickup right here and run over to the ah to our shed here. And I want to get the cow manure into the wagon. Those headlights really work well. Is that the front or the back? That's the front. Okay. Back up. What just happened? Ah. Uh, filling the poopy wagon with upward poop. How full are we now? 80 per 64 percent. Right? So this has 64 percent full, and there's zero manure stored. So we'll just keep filling this guy up until it's full, and then once that's full, we'll take it and spray it around on the fields. We'll do these fields first, obviously. These, are, these fields are prepped for next year. They've been plowed and cultivated. Um, let's play around a little bit with the cultivation, actually. Um, because uh, no, yeah, let it go. There we go. All right. Um, I remember. I think the plow's over on the other side here. But I want to. Let's just. I just want to play around in the mud and see how hard it is to get this thing plowing in the mud. Plowing in the mud. It is definitely getting mucky. Nope. All right. And we've attached the plow to the jack bear. And I'm not able to, didn't have enough room to turn the corner. There we go. Can't see what I'm doing because of the wonderful camera angles. There we go. All right. We're kind of way up to the field that we've just done. Field's covered with wheat fuzz, and we need to plow that under. There she blows. Zoom out here. And we're going to get this field chopped up into half. Probably the, the halfway mark across there. Ah, the camera controls are so aggravating with this. It's the only thing I don't like about the Steam controller. Um, so let's lower the machine. And get the cruise control. 
patrol on, and off we go. Yeah, it's not too bad. Not having any issues really pulling it. I thought it would be a lot harder, actually, with the rain. But maybe because it's got the, uh, the leftover, like, unharvested pulp, maybe that makes it a little bit uh, easier to do. Like, there's, it's not just dirt, it's got traction. So we're going to need to start earning more social points. I'll have to do some more jobs for people. Um, you definitely earn more money in this game buying and selling these fields until you have to buy them at full price. When you run out of you know, your social standing, then it's going to start getting expensive. So I feel like we're better off right now using up our social points but and buying lots of fields. But once that social store is, is our social points are used up, it's no longer a good deal to buy the field, so we'll just buy them until we have no more social points, and keep working on saving social points, so. Alright, so that started. I just wanted to see if it was any different. Let's run the tractor on the part that has been plowed now, see if it's harder to run on. No, it runs along well. It's fine. Okay, so we know that that works. Um, and we'll go ahead and... We're going to drive around now and pick up some jobs from neighbors. Mostly just trying to line jobs up, and then we'll do them as we need to. I don't know how many you can pick up at a time. If you can only pick one up at a time, or if you can do a bunch, but... I'm glad I have the pickup truck because it makes it a lot easier to to do jobs. So that's cool. That'll be fun. I'll work on that stuff off camera. Obviously, this gets pretty tedious watching somebody plow over and over again. So, just like Farm Expert, we will uh, conduct ourselves in the same manner. Oops, wrong button. Crap. Now, I heard the chainsaw is for cutting down those, like, these bushes that are dead everywhere. I can clear the yard with the chainsaw. Um, so I probably will end up picking one up, maybe. It's kind of pricey for it. doesn't do a whole lot, and it's kind of pricey, but it may be worth it. All right. So we've made ruts all over our yard, but what are you going to do? Let's go ahead and hop in the pickup truck and see who we can find. Who can we talk to? Look at the mud all over the truck. <laughs> And once again, you can clean the equipment. The rain does tend to keep it clean. But uh, let's go ahead and take a look. Who's out? No one's out. Wow. It's raining. <sighs> yep. So apparently everybody just goes inside when it rains. Got a bunch of places, place to relax, place to relax, to meet people, just chill and relax. And it doesn't look like anybody's down there because it's raining, so it seems like people just kind of hide away when that happens. We'll go downtown and see if there's anybody there. I don't think we'll meet anybody, though. But what the heck. We got time. At least John is out. Hey, John. Beep, beep. Uh, which way is town? I think it's up there. I love the... The road signs. I, speaking of tires and wheels, I had to get... And lights, I had to get new... Um, that car that I just bought needed... Uh, I took it to the, the, the uh, tire place. Of course, they want to sell you tires, but I knew... I had kind of looked the tires over, and I'm like, hey, these are... They're passable, but they're not great. And they definitely had uneven wear because the car needed an alignment. And I think the guy 
just that owned it before just kept rotating them rather than get the car aligned. And so he just basically ruined a set of tires because you could tell they still probably had 80% of their tread in places, but the tires were all worn like sideways. And it's just like, dude, you idiot. 80 bucks and you could have saved like a $400 set of tires. Anyway, he didn't. So I, now I had to buy a whole set of tires. So I got a set of tires and, uh, man, they need to add cars to that train. And a, um, and uh, an alignment and now the car drives so, it drives so much better and because they, they, I, they were, I had them take off the um, it had these really crappy wheel covers that were all cracked and stuff and you couldn't get them off because they were bolted onto the wheels and I'm like just leave those off he's like you want me to keep them I'm like no throw them away please and so they chucked them and I put new ones on and man the car looks so much better with the wheels like the new wheels on it alright so here's town I'm not sure you know, there's places marked here as places to hang out and do stuff, but nobody ever seems to be able to talk in these places. Like, I don't, they haven't really scripted this out. I don't think anybody's even here. Am I hearing people talking? Nothing. Aw, oh, people just fair weather friends, man. Yeah, I'll just disappear when it rains. So I guess I'll just continue plowing. <laughs> Boring. All right. Well, I'm going to head back to the farm, and I'm going to plow that field up, and uh, I'll catch back up when there's actually something to report. Uh, but uh, this is kind of... Basically, that's the I can only really do that task. There's no work to do for anybody or anything like that while we're st stuck out here waiting. So see you in just a minute.